Yo, are you trying to load up a downloaded modded game save of Burnout 3 Takedown on your soft modded original Xbox? I will show you how I was able to make my downloaded game save load successfully in Burnout 3. Let's get started. You can try to use the action replay for the Xbox to try and transfer game saves over, but because it's been over 15 years since the console's release, and using modern computers doesn't really work at all. Soft modding your Xbox along with using an FTP server program like FileZilla or WinSCP, you can transfer anything between the Xbox and PC all day long. Click the link in the description below to Mr. Mario's video where he'll walk you through on how to soft mod your original Xbox. There is a application that you want to install on the soft modded Xbox. And that installed program, if you go to application, is Zoed Trainer Launcher. So why do we want this one? Well, if we hit in, let's go in there, Zoed Trainer Launcher. There is the trainers for different games on the console that you can use in order to enable certain things to happen or to turn on or to bypass or whatever. And since the Burnout 3 disc is inside the console already, it's just showing the Burnout 3 trainers that are available. But if I don't have it inside the console, then it'll show a full list of games that are supported with the trainer. So. What we want to do is actually enable this, Burnout 3 Takedown NTSC-J. That is Japanese, but it will work on PAL, I'm assuming, because I don't have PAL, I'm in Canada, so NTSC-U would be for me. And hit the option 1, crack HDD key, check, enable it. That's what we want. Hit start to load the game and that option. And let's get into the game. So at the beginning of the video, we saw that the file was unusable and that's without using a trainer. So if we use the trainer, let's see if it'll work now. And it does. La 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 la. Right there, profile one. Looks like 100%. Let's get into it, load successful, so we can actually do whatever we want here. So driver details, yeah, 100% completed. So everything is done. So yeah, that's how you can actually load Burnout 3 game saves to work on your soft modded Xbox. However, we do want to do one little thing first. Instead of just leaving it as is, I would recommend that we save the profile on the console. So we go to profile here, we save it, and we can actually move it here to profile number two or profile number one. Let's save it here, overwrite it. We can do that. You can change the name if you want to. And let's back out of that. We can. We can get out of the game by holding left trigger, right trigger, start and select. And that'll take you out of the game and back to the main screen. So now what we want to do, I bet you can just turn the console off and then turn it back on and then reload the game and it should work. But in the case of the trainer actually staying on, we want to turn it off. So. Let's turn it off and see what happens. Now that is turned off, so now we are launching the game again. But because we saved the game again, saved the profile, the hard disk drive in the console that you're using will assign new keys to have the save work with the, the hard drive. And you don't need the trainer to work it anymore. So there you go. It'll load up, no problem, and you can use it without even needing to use the trainer. So there you go. 
There you guys have it. I hope this helps you in allowing you to successfully load a Burnout 3 game save and start playing from where the save had left off. Leave a like on the video if this helped you and leave a comment down below what your favorite thing about Burnout 3 is and whether or not this game deserves a remake. Cause I certainly do. This is my favorite Burnout game and yeah, there's nothing quite like it. Burnout Revenge is the closest thing to it, but I just love this game. I grew up with this game. I loved playing this game with my friends. And yeah, it was a lot of fun and it's still fun to this day. It'll never stop being fun. So yeah, have fun playing the game with the downloaded saves and I'll see you next time for more. Later.